how can you speak about being free if you don't have a job, you don't have a roof over your head, your kids, you can't afford to send your children to school or to decent school, you don't have any retirement security, and there's constant wars going on all the time. That's not really a political democracy. So when I speak of an economic democracy, I mean literally jobs for all, full employment economy, health care for all, a national health care program, no, no private insurance companies involved, education for all, free education from K all the way through to college, and pay for doctors too who, who want, someone wants to go to medical school, they should get some public service in return, but we should pay for that too. Uh, Social Security should never be privatized. We sh we, it's easy to actually save Social Security, just lift the caps. So, I mean, that's just the beginning. Uh, this idea we bought into that war is somehow uh, necessary to preserve our democracy is hypocritical, it is false, it is a lie, and it has to be challenged. And so peace has to be part of the economic democracy as well because you, you, you can't have a political democracy if you have constant war. Look, we're in a national security state right now where the, the, the reach of that national security state is into people's emails, their, their um, medical records, their financial records with the Patriot Act. Every day is orange at every airport in America. Uh, the, the manner in which uh, whistleblowers are being attacked, uh, they're, they're in more trouble than people who commit serious breaches of the law. Uh, the way in which Bradley Manning's uh, uh, detention is uh, being conducted. All, all, what all this points to is a country that really isn't responsive to democratic principles. Enjoy Grit TV? Want more people to see it? Well, we are making our program available free to public television stations coast to coast. If you would like to see our show on your local public television station, please give them a call and ask for Grit TV with Laura Flanders. Thanks.